All right, we are here at the Forgotten Stoneworks talking to Dan about building a fire pit and we're starting with the first thing, fire brick. So Dan, why are you cutting these fire bricks? Uh, we cut the, the top at an angle so that we can miter the stone into it to keep, keep the stone protected from the heat but still have a look of a, of a solid cap on the top. That sounds like a good idea, Dan. Is that a lot of work? Uh, a little bit, but it's, it's a much better product. You don't get cracks in your mortar. But the amount of time you spend sawing, probably a half an hour, 45 minutes, it'll save you from having to tear out your joint line every year and replace it. Huh, that makes sense. So, Dan, what are you cutting these on? Uh, you got a stone saw with a diamond blade. So, if somebody doesn't have a big saw like this, is there another way that they can do it? You could use a skill saw with a diamond blade on it, seven inch diamond blade, or if you were real crafty, you could probably use a grinder. So these, how much is a seven inch diamond blade? About $50. Well, that doesn't sound too bad because, so how many cuts did you have to make here? Um, 26 cuts. Oh, so how did you determine 26 cuts? The, just the, circumference of the circle and then the four inch brick. Cool. It would well, depend on the size of the fire pit. Cool, cool. Well that sounds, so you just took the circumference and divided it by four. Right. That sounds easy. Well we can't wait to see the next step. Thank you Dan.